Our digital dive, a story that people here in Minnesota just cannot get enough of that victory against the Falcons yesterday. It was 28 to 12 at the end of the game. It was quite the game, too, for the season opener. But a lot of people are talking about this video of Kirk Cousins kind of doing like a dad dance. I mean, he is a dad, so I know dads who dance way better than that. Okay, he's just like, yeah, he's got to work on it. I don't even Diggs is like, okay, buddy, it's time to work on those dance moves. Uh, Lindsay sharing this photo of a group of friends saying they are from Minnesota, but they currently live in Wisconsin. They made the trek to the game and I'm glad they're not Packer fans. Loving the Vikings. Keep the photos coming. Sandra sharing this one of her looks like her husband and her son there. Happy Vikings fans. Raising them young to be Vikings fans for life, setting up for, you know, some maybe some disappointment, <laughs> heartbreak <laughs> over the years. And uh, this one of our four legged furry friends. Oh, Jack. Jack. Rooting for the team. Jack doesn't give know what's up. He just is like, give me some of those vegan strips or, I don't know, some dog treats. All right, we asked folks, use 11 words to describe your feelings about uh, the Vikes. Week one victory. This person says, you're only as good as your last performance. Celebrate, sleep, and repeat. Good advice there. Good advice. Um, and a lot of folks, though, already talking about a Super Bowl visit maybe. We might be getting ahead of ourselves. Zach says, simmer down. We shall see. I hope we go all the way, but I'm not holding my breath. Mm -hmm. As Vikings fans, I mean, you should know. If you're a true Viking fan, you know. Yeah. Don't I mean, get your hopes up too high. The season's also eight minutes over, you know. Like, there's a long way to go here, okay? <laughs> a long, long way. But 